What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Wisco Angling. Uh, today we're on it. We're oh, we're back at that little spillway here, and you guys really liked the last one, so I'm gonna kind of do the same. Oh, a big big bass! Just get, two pounder literally just came through this hole. It's crazy just seeing all the fish that come right through swimming here. But the plan is, I'm gonna kind of do what I did last time. Stick that. Ooh, kids again. Stick the GoPro down in here, and I got some worms. I'm gonna throw some worms down in there while the camera's down there, and just watch you guys, or let you guys watch them eat. So, hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> Thank you. 
All right, guys, so of course the camera was off. For the one time, but I had to show you guys this. So back in here, there are these little suckers. You don't catch them often, but it's only the second time I've caught one. Mandy's over here slaying fish too. She caught a bass off camera, of course. Oh, look at that fish. Sorry. <laughs> Habit. I just put my palm between my legs. Oh. Look at that, guys. Beautiful pumpkin seed. Or red or sunfish, whatever you guys want to call it from the way that you're from. They got some beautiful fish stocked in here. Like I said, they all come right from this spillway and that one, but most of them come right out of this one. If the sun's looking just right, you can see and watch the fish bite, but... Oh, there's another sucker right here. You see him? Mm -hmm. You see him right there? Oh, come on. Oh, you got one on. One was just messing with yours. I just watched him. Another little pumpkin seed, sweet. These are beautiful fishies. Woo. Oh. There, no, he was swimming over here, but Bluegill came up and got this one. Usually these fish back here don't ever bite anything. But for some reason right now, they're being sort of aggressive. I hope you guys are enjoying these clips here. This is cool stuff. You saw Mandy, me and her were fishing in here and obviously everything in this beautiful clear spillway. I don't even know if you would really consider it a spillway. I can, I'm considering it a spillway, but yeah. Also, when we were over by the actual lake over there on the on the dock, and we saw I saw a little musky. So I'm gonna show you guys when we saw that. Roll the clip. Is he still there? Yep. So yeah, I thought that was pretty cool, honestly. Oh, you guys are there, maybe a little bit better, but I thought that was cool. Um, I put in, I'll show you, oh, we also tried fishing for it. So we tried catching it with a worm and seeing if that worked. So here's that footage. But yeah, so that's going to do it for this one. Um, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you guys are new. Uh, like us on, go follow us on Instagram. Make sure you guys go check out Runsel. Honestly, we just did that real, that re real review video. Some good stuff. They got really cool stuff on there. Good line. I use their line because it's so good. They got really good braid line. Um, honestly, my whole, she took the poles, but my whole pole is a Runsel rod and a Runsel reel and Runsel line just because it's, it's damn good stuff. So 
I highly recommend them. Uh, links down in the description for those guys. Use code WISCO123 for 10% off. If you guys want, go cop yourself some Runcel stuff. But yeah, like I said, that's going to do it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Like, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one.